Still another stakeholder in the NLEX SETEX integration of management and operation and the payment system is more good news for motorists, commuters, and the general public. Here's our field correspondent Zera Hernandez with more details. Unknown to the general public, the Basis Conversion Development Authority has been instrumental in many projects that have made life better for motorists. The BCDA also played a major role in the establishment of development corridors, echo zones linked by well-planned tollways and roadways. While now working to facilitate the integration of the operations and toll payment system of the NLEX and the SCTEX, the BCDA is working on other projects aimed at developing a new major urban center north of Metro Manila, complete with roads and other infrastructure. Well, the biggest project that we have is not only road infrastructure, but um, uh, an entire city. In fact, the Clark Green City will serve as the new metropolitan area in the Philippines. So uh, we are hoping to uh, break ground within the year. So there will be a lot of construction, a lot of infrastructure, both roads, uh, water utilities, power. So that would be uh, a new metropolitan area. Meanwhile, the BCDA is updating its plan to establish a monorail system linking central business districts in Metro Manila after the Department of Transportation and Communications aired studies to develop a subway system in the metropolis. Well, the monorail system has been updated uh, because uh, currently it's the DOTC now who's taken the cudgel in uh, leading the construction of a uh, mass transport system that would connect at central business districts. I, they, I've heard that uh, the NEDA ICC has already approved the subway system that would connect the Ayala Central Business District with Bonifacio Global City and up to the airport. So that, that, that is actually a uh, development uh, change in the plans because the monorail has been, based on our feasibility study, it's quite more expensive but uh, we want a higher capacity mass transport system and I think the subway system is a uh, uh, good direction to move forward. Motorists and commuters as well as the general public should be aware and air support for the various mass transportation projects in the pipeline. This should help move these projects forward to implementation.